guys, Brad Duct Tape Hale here, getting ready to bring you guys into the fourth episode of this Let's Play of Welcome to Fallout 4. In the last one we got done beating a Deathclaw super early in the game, so uh, let's see where this goes. Uh, <clears throat> that was a pretty amazing display. I should hope so. I'm just glad you were on our side. Yes. Yes, I am on your side. Well, unless you double cross me. The feeling's mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Or Facebook. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. Oh, okay. So here. I need 20 everything bucks. Everything you've done, thank you. Uh, okay. Oh, I got more than 20 bucks. That's right. quite nice. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. Hmm. We could use your help getting settled you, there. You mean my house that's already in Sanctuary? But, okay. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? You're a I've little weird. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Okay. My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time, out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Okay. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just... His life force, his energy. He's out there. Even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should stop looking. <laughs> What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. I hope so, because I want to throw that sound clip in more often. This. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now hey. let's get Sounds going. Sounds like you better get going Sanctuary to Diamond City. Awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gorge? <laughs> you want us to just head out on a... Eh, uh, she a druggie. Remember kids, don't do psycho. Ah, oh, I love throwing in that sound clip. I really do. And I have a feeling it will not be the last time. Alright, so apparently they're going to be living in my hometown, so might as well reload my weapon. Okay. Let's go take a look through all the bodies that I have not fully looted yet. Hmm. Kind of scattered around. Ah, there's one. Alright. Uh, and there's another. You're dead naked, you're dead naked. I'll go down you later. You're probably full of, like, good stuff. Yep, yep, you're accessible. A death claw ripped your legs off. Is there any soda in here? No, there's no soda in here. Alright. Is this an escort mission? I really hope this isn't an escort mission. And that bird just fell. Okay, let's try one of these new auto pistols. <laughs> yes! Aw, you don't leave gems like the birds do in uh, Resident Evil 4. Oh, darn. That's not a bad starter weapon. It doesn't exactly do a lot of damage, but it does a lot of little damage quick. Alright, so there's 
There's nothing on there. I don't really have a lot of power left with this power cell. I really hope they aren't hard to find in the game. What you got over here, boy? What are we doing? Are we taking the shortcut? Yeah, I think you're taking the shortcut. Or you're just trying to find a spot to go pee. Yeah, I think we lost our group. Let's go find our group. Okay. So there's the gas station. What is this? Is this a hole in the ground? I think it is. That means there's stuff to explore. Is this where all those mole rats were? Yeah, I think that was. Yeah, boy, I think there are mole rats in there. I'm gonna go shoot them. Alright. Let's see if they took anything good down here. Ooh, it's all kind of glowy. Mm. Yep. Sleepy little mole rat. Dead mole rat. <laughs> pew pew! Oh, damn it. Kind of, you know. <sighs> I love, I love Fallout. I love to pieces. But I kind of get tired of the action points. I really get tired of the action points. Because I'm like, please don't tell me I'm too stupid to shoot this gun. I have to let it game back. salvageable down here. Ooh. So there's that. Okay. All this squishy fungus. Oh, apparently it's brain fungus. And I took it. Oh, wow, there's a lot of it. Okay, we got this. And a lot of this. squishy. Ooh, what's going on my red meter? Oh, sweet! Fusion core! Well, hopefully enough of these got left out. Okay. That's the way I came in. More brain fungus. Alright, is there anything over here? More brain fungus. Up, up, creatures. said pretty much everything you can get in the game is salvageable for something, so. Alright. Can I get in there? Damn bobby pins. They just don't make them like they used to. fungus I didn't see. Because that was the radiation. Was that? Alright, this is the way I came on it. Yeah, I'm actually like running low on power, so I need to get this back to the station. Wait, no. No, it says I have a reserve one, so... Okay... They're probably, like, way super ahead of me, so let's see where they're at. Alright. Let's walk out this way. Jump, 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 jump. 
Where's the gas station? Oh, no, there they are. God, they're slow. I've been dispatching, you know, the little nick and roll rats. They all walking on over here. All right. Guys, welcome to my hometown. One rule, I, I rule it. Plain and simple. Rule number two, I still rule it. So. And again, if you guys see any jump cuts, it's just me cutting out pointless, you know, loose stuff, me checking my menu and whatnot, so. Oh, you've already moved Just in wanted to trade homes. a few things. Hmm, cool. Eh, what can I trade her? Two caps? We should keep moving. Don't want to be pinned down when the raiders come. <laughs> pinned down. Kinky. Yeah. Oh, I can't do that while in power armor. All right. But yeah, uh, the trade system's kind of weird. I, I hope I've learned it a little bit better. There's a lot of unexplained new stuff with this, so just a matter of learning it. Oh. Um, I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. Yeah. What do you think? I already kind of call it home. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I'm, I'm pretty old. It's a die job. It hides my gray. I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Yep. My son. My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Yeah, I have Let me know if there's any way I can help. I have a anyway, feeling the whole game is going to be me here. searching. Hmm, awkward. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I figured. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Okay. The trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? I have a feeling you're probably going to give me some caps and experience, but I'd sure. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgeon. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Sure. I need to learn how to do this whole building a settlement thing, too, so. Alright. Okay, I got some leveling up, but, um... The suit's kind of running out of power, so... If I remember correctly... Yep. Yep, there's one right here, so... I can't transfer. I need to get out of my suit. Oh, okay. I need to exit. Alright. Back up. Okay. How do I get you into the power station? Oh, sweet. Cool. That gets you right there. Alright. Let's figure out what I need to do. Because apparently it shows that I have some damages on this and I need to fix them. So, Okay, I'll deal with that later. A lot of this I have to kind of look up online to figure out what and what not. Hey, do you have a moment? I wanted to um, thank you. For helping sure. us out in Concord. Not a problem. If only we'd run into you sooner. Eh. Don't mention You're it. an NPC. Don't worry about it. You guys have been through hell, huh? You have no idea. In these past few months, we've lost everything. My son, he's... He's gone. Aw. Are you inserted in here to make me feel bad? Feel. I'm apparently shirtless I with metal over my chest. Lost someone, too. But you and I, we're still here, right? We have to go on. For them. We do. You willing to do some work? Uh, side quests? Sure. I'd be glad to help. Just tell me what you need. 
Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Okay. These old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Yay, I can actually start crafting stuff. Okay. Let's try this on out. Also, because this does take a while, I am going to be speeding this on up and giving you guys a little bit of a montage of how to go through and craft some of the stuff. cut quite a lot of that out actually because there is a lot of like little side stuff here and there where you go through and you scrap stuff out but uh right now i'm still currently going on the mission that i was handed for the minutemen uh there's a tiny little establishment a little bit north it's it's not that far to get to um it's about a mile or so away but you find two settlers that are talking about they're getting trouble from raiders so um i'm just wandering down i've actually found my first wandering dealer so that's kind of nice so they're making me head towards the city. Ooh, that looks like a duck. We had a deal. Uh oh. Me. Hand over the good. The people you over here. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? Fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Yeah. You go dot. You go squish. Ah, uh, but you aren't the cautionary. She doesn't involve you. All right, I have a feeling I'm gonna get hired. That's right. Walk away. Hi. Uh, We're closed. Uh, you can thank that poison seller outside for that. Uh oh. Why? What's going what on? What do you do? Wolfgang thinks I owe him money. I say he got my son Patrick hooked on chems and cheated him out of our savings. Look, I've been in a shootout before, and I don't like our odds. You for hire? I've got a hundred caps if you help us get rid of that chem pusher. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll just root their bodies and take their stuff. I said, yes, I'll do it. Come on, button. Maybe it's a minor right, glitch. Trudy. Okay, there you go. I'll get rid of him. Thank you. I'll back you up from here. Go get him. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Bullet sandwich. Like I don't get enough of that already. Yeah. And he dead. Yeah, he's soon to be dead. There we go. You're dead now. Take 
your stuff. Alright, so one of the Raiders has had probably one of my most favorite guns from the Fallout New Vegas thing. It's a Thompson! Freaking Tommy gun. I love this thing in Resident Evil 4, so... Probably one of my most all-time favorite weapons. So, all right, I'm going to go in here, and uh, no, I'm not trying to shoot you. I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. Yay! Now, if you ever need to trade, my shop's open. Money! Sure, let's take a look. It's all worth every cap on charge. And I leveled up! Okay, all right, now that's all done. That's all taken care of. And, um... Yeah, as I said, if you see jump cuts... It's me just cutting out me checking my pimp boy for the map location. A lot of dead air that's not needed, so. Alright, we gotta figure out our correct location to go take out these bandits, but uh, let's make sure that we got everything we need here. Yeah. I can rest sure easy knowing everything. that Wolfgang is rotten in hell. Yep, that Thank NPC's you. dead. Not like, you know, I'm not gonna I'll see hundreds anything. more. I'll take a look. Um, sure. All salvage, but nothing's junk. Hmm. Okay. Well, I got what I needed. I'm going to keep heading towards the city. Apparently, there's just, like I said, a bunch of bandits inside a factory. So, ooh, careful. A bunch of bandits inside of a warehouse or a factory I'm supposed to be taking out that are causing problems. They're kind of far out. I don't mean far out as in cool. I mean, like, they're pretty far away from the area that they said they were causing trouble. So, I'm just like, all right, whatever. So, it's just an excuse for me to traverse even further. This is basically another Minutemen mission. Alright. Nothing the VAT system's given off. Yeah, that's a tip to any of you new Fallout fans, is if you're trying to find something you can't quite spot with your naked eye, your VAT system will detect it. No, depending more on your stats and whatnot, but still, the VAT system will pick it up. What is it, boy? You being a good dog? Yes, you are. Alright. Yeah, I think apparently it's supposed to be that giant structure in the background is what I'm trying to get to. But I think I'm going to have to sneak through the city a little bit. Okay. Let's climb the... Ooh! Yep, I'm in Lexington. Alright. I saw a light up here, so that might mean that they... Yep, yep, there's a station. Do I have enough material that I can um, upgrade my weaponry? And I did! Uh, I tweaked out my Thompson, I tweaked out my shotgun, so now it's a sawed-off double barrel, and I tweaked out my pistol, so. And my Thompson has a larger ammo drum, so, cool. And I can't go through that way. Alright, I'm getting near the city, so that means there's probably bandits or whatnot here, so, uh, let's try this on out. It's, like, super, super dead, and I know it's post-apocalypse, but still. Red Rocket. I'm still laughing about that. <laughs> Red Rocket! Red Rocket! God, I'd kill for some action right now. Ooh, it's a dog meat found an enemy. Ooh, where is he, boy? My shotgun is waiting for them. Come on. Over here. And, okay. Huh. Lovely ghouls. They're not too bad of an enemy. They're quick, but they're not too bad of an enemy. Let's see how well they got upgraded in this game. And, yep. Yep, it's feral ghoul. Great. Ah, let's see if there's a way up to them. I have a feeling I'm going to have to take them out and probably not in open quarters. Okay. Um, is there an entrance over here? Or that? Yep, there's an open door. Will this take me up? Uh, no, it's a shop. So, well, guys, I think we're running near the end of our episode. So I'm going to say thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I don't think there's anything around the corner. Okay. And, guys, remember, please be like duct tape. Stick to it.